what's up guys in this video i'm going to show you guys how to create this youtube intro using CapCut on your smartphone all right so you don't need much you just need to get CapCut installed on your smartphone and just we're going to use text use a background video and then we're going to use any icon of your choice so i'll show you guys where to get all these materials as well so enough talking let's get into it all right let's get started if you want background videos go to pexels.com so i'm just going to go and search pexels.com open the first link and then you're going to change go here and change your search from photos to videos and then you're going to search intro and you're going to see intro videos that you can use so many of them you just have to go through and select this is one it's an example of an intro video if you need it just click on download okay so that's just it there's a, there are so many you just need to find the one that best suits you for example this is one right here so you click on download you're going to get that downloaded in your device so that's where you can get intro videos but the one i'm going to be using i'll leave the link in the description if you're willing if you want it just go and download it from there all right next go ahead to CapCut and click on new project and go to library up here now we're going to select this black background and click on add so this is a six seconds background okay now i go to text click on add text and then i'm going to put like my name i can go to styles now I'll go to effects and choose any cool effects that you like i want something that looks more cinematic this effect is not bad i'm going to click on okay so i've got my name there so i can scroll here to the end of the text and i'll highlight the main video split and delete i want the video to be at the same length as my text i'll delete this cap cut advert here and then i'll export that in my device all right click on done all right next step click on new project and import the background video that you want to use so this is mine this is my background video that i'm going to use so i always delete this cap cut advert here all right, all right so shift your timeline to about half like here where it's just the smoke left the fire is complete and then you click on overlay click on add overlay and take the video that we just saved okay now the clip the overlay clip is highlighted scroll to remove bg click on chroma key and you're going to select the white back the black background out of it and you're just going to be left with the text like that all right next thing is to add keyframe so you're gonna have our keyframe button here so click on keyframe you're gonna add keyframe on the overlay clip then go to mask click horizontal mask and we're going to rotate our our line our mask line to about 90 degrees and then shift it to the back like that now we're going to move our timeline a little bit like that see how the smoke is almost getting off the screen for them from the background video then we shift our max line to reveal the name or the text like that and click on okay so you're going to have something like this okay that's what you're going to have now next step i want to come here very close to this if you highlight this clip you're going to see both of your keyframe this is one and this is another so i want to come very close to the second keyframe like this then i click on split this other part of the text video that is highlighted this one because this is the other little half here i'm going to apply an effect to it so let's go to effect this effect right here click on video effect scroll through and go to glitch and then we're going to apply the fuzzy effect and click on ok so that's what we have the next thing we need is our sound since we have the effect so we're going to go to sound just highlight uh, go back to audio then go to sound effects and then we're going to search for glitch glitch sound And we're going to click on plus sign to add it so if your sound is if it's short like for example just play it now and see so now if you want to make your glitch sound to be longer just duplicate it okay so you're going to have it like this perfect now let me highlight the first text the second text sorry the half that we split there, this is it all right here at this point we're going to go back to overlay and we're going to add our icon is a youtube icon if you want this you can just get this on google search youtube icon and you can download any icon on google okay so i'm going to resize it and i'm going to give it the same effect i give the text so let's do that video effect and i'm going to add fuzzy to the icon right another thing i'm going to do is i'm going to give the icon an animation so let's go to animation while highlighting the overlay icon and then we're going to take fit in this one right here and we set it to 0 0.4 that is it so make sure this is centralized okay 
that is it guys so now let's see what we have so far all right now at this point i want my main video this one to be the same length with the text and the same length with the icons i'm going to split these two and cut the part that i don't want so like right here where the video ends here i'm going to highlight the text split delete highlight the icon split delete now i want to add the other part of it so i need a blank background so i'm going to click on the plus sign here click on library i'm going to add that same black background add now at this point where the both meet i'm going to add an effect to this part of the clip the black background so highlight it highlight it and go to effect go to video effect then we're going to look for opening and closing click on it scroll down and look for tv off so we have that tv off effect now we need a tv off sound so just click on go to audio sound effects now search for shutdown so we're just going to add this so now let's play it and see what we have now since this clip is long you can see that so after the shutdown sound we're going to split it and delete the rest so play it here so that's perfect i'm just going to highlight this split highlight this split and i'll delete that is it guys so that's all you need to do so it's a very easy tutorial i hope you like this video all you need to do now is to decide how you want to save it your resolution and all that and when you're done click on export and you have it in your device so this is our youtube intro all right guys that's it for the tutorial it's very easy and i hope you learned something new today if you want to support this channel hit that like button and if you're new to my channel feel free to subscribe and let me know in the comment section if you want to see more tutorials like this see you guys in the next video